You can read a lot of books, you can read a lot of articles, but uh, this is not enough if you have not practical skills. Hi everyone, this is Dr. Vikas, my friend Mark. So right now we are in Palm from State Medical University. So we are in campus, uh, simulation center. So in this video, we'll try to understand why the simulation center is necessity for our health workers, our students to improve their practical skills. So let's have a view. So you can see there is a debriefing hall. So we'll try to more understand what exactly. So you can see it's my friend Emilia, Hi. my colleague. Nice to meet you guys. Today I want to show you the cool device. This is a body interact. It's my favorite device here because here you can see a lot of clinical uh, diseases different from cardiology, neurology and others. And you have a man, you can see the man with a heart attack, he has a sweating, he has a high heart beating and we can treat him and we can uh, think about his diagnosis. Okay, uh, let's see something. We uh, we can see a uh, blood pressure. Pulse. So there is a blood pressure, yeah. So guys, you can see. Can you please zoom? You can see there is a blood pressure, pulse rate, breath rate, oxygen level. So we have many more things. So let's start. So you can see. We can start some option. So this is it for temperature. I think we we'll start from here. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. So we can calculate temperature. This is a sugar level. So this is a sugar high. level. Yes, you can see the ECG. Now we have the, this is a heart attack. Yeah. For example, one more, one more is uh, some назначены исследования. Some other investigations. Okay. And in this way, we can see. This is a heart attack and we can treat this man and help him. After this, we have a, a conclusion uh, with a, that it's heart attack and what we can do. So you want to say that we can put a condition yes, and he will rate yes, uh, yes, according yes. to condition. Yes, yes, yes. So guys, actually this instrument uh, uh, the for practicing, so we can put any condition and this body will rate according to a condition. So really good platform to study okay let's go another room yes doctor can say us something so right now we are in gynec section hi subon how are you hello Vikas, sir can you subon can you please elaborate yeah uh, hello my name is subon and i'm from the sixth year and this is the obstetrics and gynecology department of our simulation center uh, here we can see the apparatus like this. Uh, it is the birth simulator mannequin of our, uh, this department, and uh, it shows uh, it can demonstrate how to perform deliveries. Uh, and here, here we perform mock uh, emergency deliveries under the guidance of our professor. So uh, this type of dummies help us, uh, like uh, uh, during live. Uh, uh, pregnancies, live deliveries, the students of first, second year or the new students of third, fourth year, they are afraid to perform the procedures and uh, they are afraid that they may make a mistake. So here we can make mistakes and we can learn from our mistakes. The professor guides us on uh, the mannequins and uh, so it is very helpful for us and very comfortable for the students. So you want to say we are reducing the risk factor. Yeah. So it's very beneficial for first year, second year students. Yeah. Right? Okay. That's great. Thank you so much. Thank you. So let's continue. I think we can go in other rooms. Yeah. Yes. So guys, right now we are in pediatric section. Let's go. Hey Anush, how are you? Anush, can you please explain? Yeah, yeah. So actually, so you can see there is a live robot. So Anush will explain us. This is our pediatric robot simulator. As we all know, robotic simulator help medical students for training and face real lifetime scenarios uh, without making any patients in danger, real patients in danger. We can see, we can we can see this uh, robot. It's almost like a real uh, real human. It's having heartbeat. It's having pulse, and even we can monitor ECG, blood pressure, everything in this monitor. 
and same as that we are also having one more you know, robot for um, adults and elderly and we can see it in next room so can you please show us yeah, yeah. adult robot of course sir. And this is also based on the human and robotics. It's also having a beat and constraint. And we can we can monitor everything over this this computer. It's ECG, diastolic, systolic blood pressure, everything over there. So it's better for medical students to learn using robots. You can see the ice blinks. Even it's having heart beat. You can feel the heart beats and pulse over here. So. Okay, here we have more uh, things to see. Let's continue. Hi, Emily, really again. Hi. Hi, again, guys. And this room is really cool room too because we have uh, your, uh, some theoretical um, devices. For example, here's endoscopy. Here we can do a bronchoscopy uh, as a fabric endoscopy. And on this device, we can change the deep how much we go in. You can see on the monitor uh, the variant of bronchoscopy. Uh, for example, the one more here. We can um, cut a blood vessel, some of training, some operations on the heart. Here, our <laughs> doctors. Switch your doctors. Yeah. Performing the laparoscopic surgery. Okay, and here we can do a laparoscopic operations, uh, like a di something on diagnosis of different diseases in stomach diseases and others. We use this device. Really nice and really uh, re uh, real. real. And here we have uh, some training. Yes, different training in different organs, in the chest, in the stomach, and others. Really good room. And here you can practice everything. For example, look at the screen. Yes, some variants. Yeah, some variants you can put in, and then this one. To very sensitive, very sensitive and very useful. Thank you. And go to the other room, the last room where we show you one more. Hello, uh, this is a CPR room where you can see uh, the high technologies can help us to improve our practical skill. Uh, let's start, let's show. Yes, here you can see uh, to it. Very, very bad. Uh, put your uh, put your uh, hands in the middle of the chest. Uh, strength your arms. In. Strength your arms. Uh, put uh, uh, push by all your body. Push by all your body more deeply. Okay, more deep. Faster, like in the song. Uh, stay alive. Ta 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 ta. Stay alive. Thirty times uh, until you have to do to breathe. Okay. Here we see uh, it is better. Uh, the compressions are more effective. That's cool. Okay, thank you. We can we can continue your your size. So thank you, thank you, Mark. I hope uh, this video will help our viewers to understand more about our new city. I just want to say some highlights about our new city. So very few new city have a own simulation center. So we are lucky that we have our own simulation center in Palm State Medical University. And I want to add on one more thing that our new city have uh, has own robot, uh, humanoid robot that's called Yuri. So it's really great that our new city is working on this also. We are very very uh, lucky that uh, we have chance to perform in such a instrument. So I hope everyone like this video. So. Yes, yes, thank you guys. Welcome to Perm. Welcome, Welcome to, to our university. It's really good uh, university and we and Mark, uh, we finished this and we are so lucky. Welcome. <laughs> so welcome to Perm. Thank you very much. Bye. Bye.